Hey everyone, Yogesh here from Utilize Business. How's everybody doing today? In this video, I'm gonna talk about how to do interlinking automatically using a plugin that I'm using it currently on a couple of my WordPress websites and it is saving me a lot of time. So stick till the end of the video. I'm gonna do a tutorial on that and then give you a link where you can actually go and get one for your website. Let's go. Hey, welcome back. So the uh, plugin I was talking about it, it is called Link Whisper. And this is a plugin that once you download it, it will automatically find all the internal links within your website and it will give you suggestion. And uh, then you can, um, you know, customize it to how you like it. And then you'll go from there. Now, first of all, this um, plugin is paid. You have to pay for it. But the amount of uh, money they're charging and amount of time it will save you finding the uh, links and linking them, it is worth it. So uh, let's go down to how much they're charging. And these are all things which you get in it, but I'm going to show you that when I log into my WordPress website's uh, backend. So right here, so if you want it for one site, it's $77. So this is annually. So you're paying this for one year. Uh, 117 for three sites and you have a lot of uh, websites out there 10 sites 167 uh, it is worth it so I've I've chosen the uh, three sites license uh, uh, I leave it up to you what you decided but whatever you decide it'll be worth it and always they have the uh, upgraded to to the next level if you want it so let's go to the back end of my um, website so uh, once you download and upload it, and I'm pretty sure you guys know how to do that. So right here, you'll have the link whisper and when you click on it, it's gonna give you a dashboard, which will give you the link status, uh, domain report, and any errors on that. So I have, uh, if you look at it, 68% are linked internal and about 32 are external. And it gives you all the website that I've linked into it, uh, link found, internal links, orphan posts that they post, which I haven't um, linked it to the other uh, website. So uh, it gives me an idea that I should be using these posts to uh, link it more uh, internally. And then it gives you error if there's any broken link or anything like that. Right now, I don't have anyone, but uh, it gives you a report on that if any of the internal links or the links are broken. So, uh, so this gives you um, an overview of what actually the plugin does and what you can do it. Let's go to the post and I'm just going to give you a, a do a test post that I already uh, copied and paste. I'm just going to show you what are the things that you can use internal links. So uh, don't worry about uh, this is just a test one so don't worry about the title and all that. Now if you scroll down all the way down right here so this is a phrase in the post upside. So it tells you what affiliate secrets 2.0. This is the post um, I did about the uh, affiliate secrets uh, 2.0 course. And then it gives you the link, right? So, and then you can just click on the one that you wanted or the one that you don't want it. So first of all, let's look at it. What is affiliate? And now it's, it's already interlinking to this one so starting out in the affiliate world and then it tells you to interlink to this now what you can do is either you can edit it to see where you want the link if you want it here or you want it somewhere else you can do whatever you want but this is pretty good so i'll save that and this is the link that uh, we wanted to enter link to so you can also do the customized link you can paste in a URL where you actually instead of uh, linking it to your own uh, website to another article within the website you can also link it to external link if you wanted it and then this gives you uh, a different one if you wanted it right so if you don't like this one uh, you have my other uh, articles there are there so it gives you an idea of that so it was just this is good and I'm just going to click on this and then you keep on going and do all the things for the for the all the articles which are suggested to you 
and what you wanted it. The other thing I really liked is what they wanted to ignore it. Let's say there's an article there that um, over uh, as an affiliate, if there's an article there that uh, the affiliate program is no longer available or they've stopped their affiliate program and you don't want to uh, promote it. So you can just click on this and it will ignore it. You know, all the interlinking will give you suggestions for your next post. So you can just click on that. What I do is links which are good. I just keep on clicking it. So this one, this program, uh, I was promoting it, but now it's no longer, uh, they're stopped promoting it now. There. So I, what I can do is just ignore the link. You about to add ignore list and will never be suggested as a link. You can just say, okay. And that's it so they won't uh, give you link for the next time and once you click on everything you just just keep on going down and once it's done so here's another one uh, ignore link And once it's done, all you have to do is click this. And what it'll do is it's going to save it and automatically link those articles within your post. And it'll take you five minutes at the most. But what I really like is you don't have just one or two articles. You have a lot of articles in there so the one is this one so you click on that right so let's preview it and it'll go into your 30 day review that I did uh, so it goes back to this article which is really good and it's all over the articles so then which will in result will give you better ranking uh, and the, one of the best uh, SEO techniques that you can use it and it takes you no longer than five five minutes or so to buy using this plugin and uh, I've seen people actually going to the original post and linking it and reading the other post and uh, what happens is the other post which was more related to this article uh, you know I interest in more and they end up uh, buying something which is linked to this so um, it is really helpful suggested you guys to start using it and the plugin is only 70 I mean if you want to just, just use it for one side 77 my suggestion I've uh, depending on you you know either take the three or the ten sites now the link will be in the description uh, go ahead uh, click the link and get it so that uh, you make your internal inking very easy all right guys Hope you enjoyed this video and uh, this is your first time watching this coming to the channel make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the notification button because we do come up with uh, new videos every week and so you are notified and you can check it out our new video thanks guys and uh, we'll see you for the next video bye